Hey everyone, this is Man in the Black Hat. And Game Collector. And we're back for more. Oh god. It's Metal Gear Solid 2. On ResoWalkthroughs.com. Okay. And it's about to get. Oh god, there we are. Yeah. Come on. There we go. Now, so we've got to deal with the stupid. Air drones with attached machine guns. Come on, where'd you go? I know there's three of you. Where's your brothers? There you are. Come on. Thank you. Eventually dying. Yes. Part of me started thinking that, you know, if you applied Fallout logic to this game, and Raiden was carrying all that shit with him, how quickly do you think he'd honestly be able to move carrying a rocket launcher and several other types of heavy gun? Two rocket launchers. That's even worse! With all of the attendant ammo. Well... Only if you're playing on hardcore mode does ammo ha does ammo have any weight. True. But still. I don't think Raiden would be moving very quickly. No, I think he'd be overburdened and unable to run. Really? The, the third one just decided to screw off? Well, that's handy. Okay. Hold on. Gotta deal with this guy. Good night. Yay! I'm sure he's glad to be asleep through this nightmare. <laughs> As I'm sure a majority of the guards are. Yeah, no kidding. And that hopefully should put no damn it. I put you out. Stay out. Stay out. You got to get out. And get to the chopper. Okay. Let's get to the next cutscene as quickly as possible. Get it over with as quickly as possible. Yeah, we're almost to the home stretch. Which is very ironic to call it considering what the home stretch mostly consists of. Damn it. What's wrong? Yeah. This door is security <laughs> level five. I don't have card. I already know what Damn. I'm going to label that particular episode to. Giving up already? Ta da! What the? Uh, Are you impressed? You should have told me you had it. I didn't show it as stupid well, as The truth is, I just remembered it myself. Ah, uh, no, that was her showing her dumb. Uh, it's stupid as she Yeah. Raiden, Emma, you're stupid as showing a lot. I mean, mm. come on! No. Or something. Come on. Really? You're just gonna wait around the corner? Oh. Okay. Come on. Get back here. Really? I wanna shoot you. Oh, that's one. You don't just want to shoot him, you want to shoot him up the tracks. Oh, well, of course. Wait. That was the sound of someone waking the Oh, crap. You know what? You die now. 
I don't think he's going to get back up ever uh -huh. again. Good. I'm hey, sure you die too. Hey, guess what? You're dead. Yay! I'll never have to be in this game ever again. <laughs> You're starting New Game Plus? Oh, shit. Okay, time for the next cutscene. I'm not even joking about that. As soon as we're through this door, we'll be ready for the... Yeah, next cutscene. You called it! Hooray! Oopsie oh, daisy! Well, on the plus side, there's a, nice, there's a nice little pause here, and I'm sure we're going to be quiet during that little secret that we actually do in this part. <laughs> Oh yes. There, there's some. Spoil. There's some parts of the let's next not, part coming up that I'll be quiet for. No, let's not spoil it. For, I, think I it's, have a question for you. It's probably one of the few, you few pleasant heights? things that you actually you get like out heights? of this game. The water's higher on yeah. the phobia list. Why? Well, we have to go down the ladder. How far down? About this game Just too. a little bit. Why do I feel like we've had this conversation before? Because you have I had this conversation before. Mm, about 130 feet? Hmm. Huh. Think you can do it? Would you take no for an answer? No. How are your legs? Better. The numbness is gone. I can climb down on my own. Okay, follow me. Okay. Now, the way Raiden is doing it is actually the safe way to descend a ladder. The way she's doing it is the way most people do it. The reason that's the safe way is it po puts three points of physical contact on the ladder at all times. And you're moving smoothly. So, yeah. Sunset. It's beautiful. If we don't hurry, it'll be the last we see. That is a nice sunset, though. Especially for this being New York. Enemy yep. soldiers, gun ciphers. I don't think we're going to be able to slip past all that. Looks like it can barely support one person. How much do you weigh, Emma? Are you going to ask me how old I am? Oh, ha ha. If you go alone, I think you can make it across. Loading. This is Ryden. Do you read me? Yeah. What's up? We've made it to the lower part of Strut L. We'll have to cross the water from here. Can Emma walk? Yeah, she's okay. The pontoon bridge doesn't look too sturdy. Emma's gonna have to cross it alone. Right. The oil fence. There are ciphers and several guards. Right. You're carrying a PSG-1, aren't you? Yeah. It's time to play sniper. Not bad. This spot gives me a good view of the targets. You're going to have to cover Emma until she crosses to Strut E. I'll get there and provide some support of my own. Thanks. Think you can handle it? Yeah, I know the drill. I faced a similar situation in Advanced Mode Level 4 VR training with the PSG-1. VR? Uh, guess it's better than nothing. Make sure you don't hit Emma. Right now, with Arsenal's boarding in progress, security should be at a minimum. That doesn't mean it's going to be easy. Given the situation, they've probably got claymores in place to make up for the security shortage. Make sure you use your thermal goggles. Right. Okay, I'm heading for strut E. Emma, are you reading me? Loud and clear. I'm gonna clear a path for you from here. How? Sniper fire. You're kidding. Trust me. What if I fall, if I fall into the sea? I, I can't swim. Who cares? A few minutes ago. Okay. We don't, obviously. Think you can do it? Would you take no for an answer? Oh. No. All right, get going. You'll be fine. Yeah, we've been kind of quiet on this because these cutscenes are actually a little bit interesting. Go figure. Early cutscenes, we gave no craps.
these cutscenes, yeah, we'll care. Okay, good sniping position right here. Thermal goggles first. There's a reason for this. See those? If you don't get rid of them, they'll kill Emma. Fortunately, we're in the most stable position, so... Yeah. Come on! Really? There we go. There we go. Okay, we're good now. What? Oh, it's Snake. Loading. This is Snake. Can you hear me? Yeah, nice and clear. I've reached my sniping position on Strut E. I'll provide support fire from here. Right. Do me a favor and take out whatever I miss. Just call me when you want me to shoot. It'd be nicer if he actually did the favor and shot what shot at whatever I missed. I'm gonna save ammo. Damn, I don't think I can do this. Snake, take over for me. I'll take care of it then. I'm going to show you how sniping should be handled. Take a good look. Jackass. My sniping field will be limited to the area you're watching through your PSG-1 scope. How does that even Keep work? Keep a look out on Emma's surroundings, even while I'm shooting, all right? How? What? Uh-oh. Die! No, don't reach for your weapon. Thank you. Oh, good job, Snake. Come on. Oh. Okay. Searching for targets. Hello. Good night. Really, Snake? Couldn't do that. I had to do that. Well, he's Snake. He's busy being awesome while you're not. Yeah, but I took out that Cypher in one shot. He failed to do so. Because he was, he was busy tempering his awesome body. Oh, come on! Is that so hard, Snake? Really? Come on. Oh! Hold on. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Um, there it is. If I managed to get this far, it must be thanks to that Raiden guy. Hmm. But he's... What is the deal with him? He's got a weird name. Dress is pretty weird, too. And I'm not really sure about the way he holds my hand and things. He's easy on the eyes, though, so I guess I can let that slide. <laughs> but I got my own ideas about that hair. I wonder if it's... Well, it must be. I could ask him later. Oh, he'd probably get ticked off. I'll leave him alone. <laughs> Apparently she wants to know if the carpets match the drapes. Sorry, Emma. Raiden's taken. Hi, Snake. Bye, an idiot. Okay, the fun bit about this... Yeah, the guys on the central spire will respawn. But you can look up and... Oh, hey, Cypher. Yeah. Just keep a lookout for Cyphers. Where did he... Oh, well, whatever. Oh, there he is. Uh-oh. 
Really? You're, you're aiming at the lady that's unarmed while you're taking sniper fire from a different direction. You guys are morons. Um... Uh, not even going to say it because it's too damn obvious. Thank you for putting it right into my line of sight, Snake. That was nice of you. Pardon me. And I think that just about does it for section two, and it's time to kill some birds. Because I can. And they're seagulls. Who cares? This sucks. I don't want to do this. We don't really care. How did all this happen? Because you're a wuss. I can't do this. Yes, you can. Stay away from good-looking women when you're fighting. Otherwise, you'll get hit with diarrhea. Hi, Johnny. One of the few things I learned from Shadow Moses. What are you talking about? Ancient history. Don't worry about it. Uh, I have no idea what you're talking about, but does this mean you're letting me go? Well, well hi, Aeronautical. a nicer way to say that, but sure. Better hurry. Thanks. Don't mention it. Just run like hell. Oh, no, my stomach. Not again. This place is about to sink! Just get out fast, fast, okay? Wait, wait! What? What's your name? Don't have one! Huh? Okay, okay fine. fine. It's Johnny! Oh, I'm not gonna make it. <laughs> hey, if we run into each other again... <laughs> Johnny on the spot. Got it. Yeah. Secret achievement. That is so worth it. Now that was just an Easter egg in the original Metal Gear Solid 2 for the PlayStation 2. But in this it's an actual achievement. Yep. So, yay. Ah oh, crap. I know what's coming up, and it really, really sucks. This is actually part of why I, I do and I don't like Metal Gear Solid 2. Don't get me wrong, it can be fun, but oh god, it drags at some points, and there's also parts like this. Damn. Oh, oh. That's not what I meant. It's about to get painful and stupid. And painful stupidly and stupid. painful. Oh, hi, Jesus. You know, having the nanobots to give him extra strength and speed and healing ability does not explain how he can land on water like a frickin' ninja. That doesn't. Okay. It... Him. There we go. Twist. Thank you. Die. And that's the last we ever see of Vamp in this game. 
Now, note where he had the knife the entire time. Note where yeah, she got stabbed. Yeah, up in the air and the fuck that happened. I don't know. This is stupid. This should not have happened. No, they should have kept her alive. Yeah. But then again, Metal Gear Solid is using Final Fantasy Live. Go figure. Pretty helpless girl that everybody likes. Yeah, let's kill her off. Game that's pretty much shown to be Solid Snake's case into the guy that Helen loves or really cares about. Well, they were trying to make it be about someone different, and if they'd managed to market it differently and make it really obvious it was about Raiden, then it probably would have been better received than it was. Yeah. Wouldn't have changed the shitty story, though. No, but the initial receiving of the game would have been better. Emma's been stabbed. That bastard! How bad is it? She's conscious, but the bleeding's bad. I'm bringing her over there right now. Raiden, get that disc over here as soon as possible. I'm afraid her time's running out. I'll be there. Funny thing is, thanks to the uh, Iraq War, in real life, they could have saved her life. Oh, this cutscene was not in the original game. This was actually added for the uh, subsistence release. Or substance release. Sub yeah. yeah, substance, because subsistence was free. And it's a completely pointless cutscene. It adds a bit of epic to the game, so I'm not going to complain too much. Emma seems to be, uh, doing something to GW's defensive capabilities. All we need now is your disc. You better hurry. I don't think she's going to make it. How's the bleeding? She's Just get over here. You'll find the coast is clear with everybody aboard our squad. Yeah. Understood. And I, I will actually say this. It's directly thanks to the Iraq War that if this had happened in real life, Emma's life could have been saved. Because... This was the 2009 of 2001. Yeah. What the... Oh, he's way the hell up there. Wait, there's something we couldn't get before. It's behind the level 5 door. Digital camera! Yeah, that, that's it. Now, if you had the Zone of Enders box, you could have used this uh, section to get in there early, but uh, why bother? Yeah. Okay. Hi. Yay, yay. Hi. Die. This is at the point where ammo. Who gives a crap about that? Yeah. No, no, seriously, you're gonna lose your weapons soon anyway, so it doesn't matter. Yes. And then you'll get them back, and then you'll lose them again. So again, it doesn't freaking matter. Just use all your ammo. Use missiles if you want. Yeah, you can use all of your ammo if you want. You can. Ow! If only Raiden could rocket jump! <laughs> okay. Uh, aiming sucks with this! That's okay. You are all the ammo! Okay. We have plenty of time before she bleeds out, so might as well explore. That's okay, she doesn't like the door. Yeah. Okay, time so to go. What's the, point of the, what's the point of trying to save her life if you're just gonna kill her anyway? Don't know. 
dramatic purposes, maybe? I don't know. This is Metal Gear Solid. If you add dramatic to anything, it becomes contrived and... Pretentious. Yeah. It becomes both of those words. And, uh, guys, we're gonna shut up now and let this scene play out by itself. How's Emma? I think he got some internal organs. We can't stop the bleeding. I'm here. Got the disc. Emma set everything up. Uh, apparently, all you have to do is pop in the disc. Uh, that should insert the virus into the AI. Is it working? Just leave it to Emma. What the? An antibody agent? Damn! The connection has been cut. Is the virus upload complete? I don't think so. The count stopped at 90%. Otacon. I don't think Emma's made any mistakes. But a portion of the worm cluster might have been altered after the disc left Emma's hands. By the Patriots? Will the virus still work? I have no idea. Hal is... Is everything all right? Uh, it's all right. Everything's all right. Good. At least I... I won't be adding another page to our family's dark history. Yeah, that's right. What if the virus doesn't work? Either destroy that thing, or take out Solidus and his men. How do we get on board? Hmm. I don't think we can. Unless somebody inside gives us a hand. Hal... I... I always... What is it? You don't hate me? Never. I never wanted to get in your way. I never wanted to hurt you. I thought that with Arsenal, if I followed in your footsteps, I could be closer. I just wanted you to look at me. Look at me as... as a woman. Hey, hey. I could... Never do that. Don't be so honest. It hurts. Sorry. Can I... Can I ask you one last favor? Sure. Call me... Call me... Emma. What? Please call me Emma. What's wrong with E.E.? E? Emma? 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 Answer me!
I didn't. I didn't leave you. Because of the accident, I had... I had a relationship with your mother. She seduced me. And it went on. My father's death was no accident. He took his own life. It was my fault, all my fault. Forgive me, Emma. Attention! Arsenal gear is ready for launch. Evacuate the upper levels immediately. Sounds like they're cutting this area loose. What do you mean? It means we're gonna sink. We have to get the hostages out. What about the camera repairs? Done. We won't be able to get everybody aboard. We'll just have to take as many as we can. My sister... ...won't be able to come with us. We will be commencing the countdown shortly. Personnel in the upper levels, head for the evacuation area immediately. I'm always the survivor. Why, Wolf? What about you guys? We got other arrangements. Huh? There's our ride out of here. Anyway, we're gonna have to sink that thing if the virus doesn't work. I should be going with you. You've got your job. We've got ours. You mean, I'd only get in your way. Wrong. Only you can save those hostages. Got it? Only you can prevent forest fires. Right. Listen, the two of you won't be able to destroy that thing. And the most badass scene in the game follows the most emotional scene in the game. Really, that's kind of why I have mixed emotions about this game. On the one hand, I really hate that it's so cutscene heavy and has so little actual gameplay. And on the other, it's emotional scenes like this one that really make it worth it. Otacon, try to get as many hostages out as you can. It's a short flight to the shore, so don't worry about overloading the cam off. And it's scenes like this that make it worth it. Even though, overall, I really dislike the game because of how it drags and the stupid story. They did this well. Tell me, why should I feel sorry for Ryden? I repeat, rush down to the upper levels. Head for the event. For Ryden? No. For Otacon? Dude went through hell twice. Yeah. How did they develop Ryden? Is what I meant to say. They really they didn't. Yeah. He has way more time to have character development and a good character arc. And they waste it. I miss you. 
but they give Hal Emmerich, like, 15 minutes of screen time in a 9-hour game. And a 10-hour game, and you have this sort of character development? From a 15-minute character? What's the minute appearance? You get this much development. What you the and fuck me. were you thinking? What Seriously! You this could have been so much better! Look at this! I'm gonna shut up because Hal gets a really good scene right at this point. Both you and I... We were always alone. Always. We only wanted to be loved. We were always waiting. Waiting for somebody. Somebody who would love us. But we were wrong. You can't wait to be loved. You have to go out and find it. Four years ago, I realized that you can't just wish for a happy family. You have to make it happen. I only wish I knew that sooner. I learned that I could love. As you probably did. Emma. The dialogue from that scene was changed slightly between the two versions. I like that version better. You think he's gonna be okay? He's tougher than he looks. Consider it done. Now, how do we open this thing? And we go you can come out now. Straight into a ninja. Not really, the... because this is actually kind of set up for some more awesome stuff. The end part of the game is actually really well done. It's just the beginning that makes it blow so bad. And, of course, Raiden's complete lack of character development. Bedtime, Raiden. I would do that. You're changing sides now? Yeah. Change sides? I don't know. I mean, I know they wanted Raiden to basically be the... Be the... The player's link to the world. But I'm sorry, Solid Snake himself had much more character Ready development in Metal Gear Solid 1, and even in 2 he has some good character development. And he didn't interfere with the character with the player's immersion into the game world. This Ryden doesn't Ryden what? really doesn't get his quote unquote development or more or less historical summary until like the last couple hours of the game. Yeah. It, it, it really does. It would have been much better if Raiden was realizing all of this throughout the entirety of the game. The entire oh hello. That was an accident, but the entire story arc. If Raiden had had all of the final 50 of his development through the entire game, it would have been much better. I would have liked the character a lot more. Instead, they tried to go for a blank slate style character that you could just jump in, like uh, Master Chief or Noble Six. That just doesn't work for this genre. Are you sure you mean Noble Six and not the rookie? You know, the mute guy with no face. Yeah, yeah, Noble Six Jack, and the rookie. Are you reading me? Are we're supposed to, to be complete blank slates? Point? Except the Noble Six actually spoke. The rookie is a mute. True. A true mute. True. But still, characters like that were designed to be blank slates, and for their game... <coughs> Pardon me. For their game, it really worked. Is he still is alive? He, still alive? Alive? he was when Olga brought him in. In this, blank slate was about the worst thing you could have done. We needed a character to latch onto and CIA. Kojima, FBI. you didn't give us one. He doesn't Not exist until in here. the database. He's a non-existent Which operative a from a non-existent organization. Kind of where the game I suspected as much. However, I know this man. Hmm? Wake him <sighs> up. We're getting into the cutscene heavy now. Yeah. Yeah, there's almost no gameplay here except for wandering a around a little bit and a boss fight. Well, two boss fights. That's it. 
The rest of this is a movie. It's been a while, hasn't it? Jack the Ripper. Oh. It also would have been nice if they revealed more of you his know character this fellow? earlier. His character history. You remember me, too. don't you? Yeah, I know. This oh. should have been something that was going on throughout the entire plant High chapter. Concentration of cerebral Instead, implant. we get this handed to have us in the last hour too? or so of the game. <laughs> this is not the time to develop your main character. This is the time to finish developing your main character and have a really strong character. You can still have a character like this and have a twist at the end. Oh God! That this is my makes son. Me think Kojima is the I, M. Night I taught Shyamalan him everything. Except. Except Kojima doesn't do self-insertion. Jack, I never, I never thought no, I'd no, see you no, again. You and know me? if you can't guess what the you title of the next episode your is, name, you're not your trying skills. hard enough. Everything you know, you learn <laughs> from me. But you know what else they waited to do? They waited to do more of Raiden's development in Metal Gear Solid the 4. 80s. A civil war. Well, you were one they of didn't really have a chance to do that, that, that before, in that conflict. So. When you were barely ten and years old, you thing. became the platoon leader of the like small boy unit. At the time, your outstanding him, kill record earned you several nicknames, including White Devil and idiot. Jack the Ripper. At the time he made this Jack, game. Yeah. I was your godfather. I this named game... Him. When the this war game ended, has so much potential to have been way better. I wondered what happened to you. I should have known they would recruit you. And he went and was stupid about it. Yeah. And this is also why we're both looking forward to rising. It's an interesting yeah. coincidence. And it's, it's supposed to come out on the Patriots, Xbox, so I will be playing it. Interest. Yay! On the what PS3 should we do with and 360, him? yes, it's a we'll multi platform We'll use him release. like you suggested. I wouldn't be surprised what if about Nintendo Dead tried Cell? to put it on the Siren Ignore side, them. too. <laughs> on the what? Oh, the Wii U. Yeah. Well, yeah, one of the launch titles is going to be Arkham City for Could it be that he's here too? Wait, the Wii U's launch title is going to be Batman In another Arkham hour, City? We'll demonstrate the power of Arsenal one gear. of the launch titles. The game's weapons. already one out! Game. Yes, proceed as planned. At but last it's going to be one well of the launch GW. titles for the console itself. Mm. Oh, How about the troops? That, wow. The men are being I don't with know Arsenal if gear that's a good idea or not. Hmm. But I, I wouldn't be surprised to see Rising come out for that console too, boss. somewhere down the line. It is going to be in a, a high-def console. After all. <laughs> yeah, and the funny thing is, is Metal so? Gear started on Nintendo. Perhaps I should be grateful to this kid for that. You're not talking about the American version, are you? No. I'm talking about the original NES game. This situation... I find yeah. it very It was released for the Famcom and the MSX. Oh, am I? Why inside Arsenal it's Gear, the MSX of course. Version that I remember. That's Actually, the one that you want we're also inside the memory yeah. of Shadow Moses. The NES one, I was kind of riddled with I'll take this back. Problems. You don't need this anymore. Yeah, anymore. It, it was a bad localization version of it. But it was still a fun game. Blowing. We shall speak again. Ah, uh, Olga Gerlukovich. Another Don't misused move. character. Stay they small. misused all the blondes in we'll this game. We'll be monitored by a camera. <laughs> what are you up to? Really, she should have had a I'm much better story arc. She had a good one. But it could have been so much I better. Think, I think Kojima just Mr. misuses blondes, Ninja? period. I mean, look at Liquid it's me. Snake. I thought you were True. the leader of the I think troops. the only blonde he didn't that completely was misuse was Eva. I was sent to provide yes, you support. I was just that. Support. Who sent you? The Colonel? No. The Patriots. No, what? I do I, kind of I deceived my troops, better. betrayed them. Yeah. yeah. Why? My I child do is gripe about being held hostage granted, by the Patriots. I may have not played it. This it is all information I've gotten. Oh, when I lost my father. 
during the but, Tanker incident. But one thing I do have my to men say and I had nowhere to go. So we joined forces with an illegal Russian organization. The We're Russian gonna have idea. to Something find a way to actually. get that game. Uh, later, you know what? If it comes out on the Xbox, I'll play it. I'll let's play it. I was I'll do it just for you guys. When I gave birth to my child, it Even as cutscene heavy as I've run, heard that it is, Patriots. I'll still let's moment, play it just for you guys. My child was gone. Five my hours baby of gameplay, is being kept somewhere in this country. <sighs> Have you ever met your child? No. Once a month, they send me a photo of my child via network. In the opening cutscene, never even held the child long. in my own. You know, it's lives. funny. If I Kojima see, doesn't kill off the blonde characters, they become think. good. That's your opinion. What but if he said, does, they're I just lost potential. Enemies. He wasn't responsible for my father's death, actually. Now, I understand that had, Sniper he, Wolf kind of had to die, but still. Two years ago, they, they were responsible for getting us out of the sinking tanker alive. Um, Olga's, Olga's little girl. Yeah, Sonny. So you were partners since the incident? No, I only found out the truth shortly before this. Huh? When I confronted oh him I here. So you boring. fought with Snake? What? When? Her name is spelled well, it was around the time you were holding hands and with that girl. The is spelled S O N Y. Snake. Yeah. Uh -huh. And it goes completely over your head. No, no, I realize what you're saying, and my so thought process is going to, to yeah, Metal Gear Solid Four no, was supposed game. to save Sony. Gain. My job was to assist you. If Solidus gets away with our support, <laughs> your mission is a failure. The Patriots would no, the well, it could have if Sony wasn't so bad at handling their customers. My child's life depends on your success. They didn't so you did it all for your way. child. No, it's but just been recently. Why do the Patriots want to help me? Are they hoping I'll take the Solidus PS2 out? Like no, you're just like me. We're well, just pawns. Yeah, it lasted like purpose. far longer than it was supposed the to. Oh, yeah. And then the PS... Huh? You'll figure it out sooner or later, and so you but I wonder if you'll handle the truth. What do you mean? I don't Listen, get that. I the time for this. Now, I so understand that the PSP was enemy. very experimental, some of them didn't work, the and they went back to the brick style so with I their latest one, what was it, Vita? Will it work? I don't know. And that's get it. me out of this Does that thing even use discs anymore? I think it does. After I leave this room. I think they actually brought the UMD back. I couldn't bring it here. If, you, and where do I if find it wasn't Snake? for the gigantic price tag on it, you know, something that Nintendo took care of in the first year on the 3DS. Yeah. The passageway ahead. If it wasn't for hangar, the gigantic price tag, I might actually I gave consider card getting for the hangar. I'm considing the getting a 3DS when I can Arsenal afford it. Here? No, even for I'm Snake, already it's getting a 3DS when I can afford it. I know, thing. I know I've to stop some of this and his men. I decided I'm not back when my DS's screen decided to go. I tried popping off and the microphone decided to stop working. Yeah. My only issue with the 3DS is the 3D system because it screws with my eyes. Well, which thankfully can, can be turned off. off. You can't keep this up. They're bound to find yeah. you. you. Listen, can turn I'll it free off. you in yeah. a little while. Brace yourself. And you can adjust it for your eyes, but it doesn't matter what setting it's on for me. It, it screws with my eyes really badly. Defeats the purpose of the console's name, but you can turn it off. Yeah. Well. Granted, how how is it? Helsing, a bridge put it. It's a stupid fucking gimmick, and everyone knows it. Yeah. Pretty much. Although the 3D effects for Jack, Amazing Spider-Man, right? and oh, yeah, I know, uh, I wrote a yeah. review of this Jack, a, long, a while ago. Said? But the 3D effects yes. for that movie it's unbelievable. didn't Drafting interfere with children, anything, so yay. It's not they actually get how to use 3D properly in movies I see now. rules don't mean a lot in war. Someone told me that there are over 300,000 children in combat right now. Um, not the 40s, it was so the remember. 70s, I I thought your memory had been... Manipulated I know there were them. some 3D it movies was, made in the black and white nightmares age. Every day. I don't Maybe think it was even the possible to make can't 3D put movies together. back then. Why didn't you uh, tell stereoscope. me? You couldn't oh, stere oh, yeah. You stereoscope was the new tried. thing, and it was a giant I failure. Want you to get hurt. And then they had it back there in the 60s and 70s, and fight. it was a giant failure. Someone put a gun in my and then they had it in the recent decade, and... 
Well, huh? It wasn't your Finally fault. worked. Um, if I survived the day's fight, I was praised, fed, and had a bed to sleep years. in. I think it's more that they finally figured out exactly how you're supposed to use 3D in a movie. Jack, and stop trying to focus in the eye. I never questioned why we fought. There was no purpose, no way out. They give you a gun, you ask how many to kill. If you didn't, you were the one they shot instead. Yay! It's okay. No one is blaming you. We were shown Hollywood action films every day. The oh, kind of macho guys oh, and big this, guns. They call yeah. it image training. Uh, this is they, so contrived right, right now because Jack into killing machines. Literally just we remembered were fed everything. Once a day, I can still taste the gunpowder they mixed into the food. Gunpowder in the food? The gunpowder had toluene in it, giving like it hallucinogenic that. properties. Holy it kept fuck. us drugged, controllable. Oh my god. This, this <sighs> I know child soldiers when the Civil really War bad ended, thing Coney those of us who survived were taken in by crap. NGOs but gave me a new life in the this States. was really contrived even for the day that it was released but nothing's changed the only <laughs> people who have no problem game, with my past have alone. secrets and agendas then of their again own. take a look at the anti-nuke message in Metal Gear night. Solid 1 I can never forget it was <laughs> really <laughs> contrived and done very heavy I'm afraid of the night that's why I don't so sit next when to Kojima you. becomes an activist about something, he does it in a really heavy hand. Told you manner. what? That I'm a killer? And always have been? No. No. What I hate more than anything this else in the done, world. This could have been done so much better, past. but not by Kojima. I didn't want you or anyone to know about it. <laughs> now I know why I was chosen for this mission. No one can take him on. Take him down. Except me. Um, I've been kept alive day. this long for he this. Actually said I knew about as soon as I saw Solidus. If I would have Jack, it, I, I love you the way you are out. now. <laughs> you have to if believe me. An American software company, his sword would have been a chainsaw. I didn't know anything about you. I admit that. Where you were born, how you grew a up. A chain sword. I, I would have now. loved to have And I know that. that what I feel for you can only get better. And I'll share in your past if that's the price. Your ways and throw them like it doesn't work that way. True. No one can but share still, the burden a of what sword. I've done. We it's must not have one that of those nice warm and fuzzy game. things couples share. I accept the good and the bad, Jack. And? That's what hey, you if Warhammer 40,000 Space Marine can have a chain sword, why can't Metal Gear? I anyone. I just want to forget about it. Because Jack, told you I haven't told you, you know, about what I've Pretty done. Pretty much, whenever something goes wrong in Metal Gear, we're just going to the say that from now on. The last two years with you. Yeah. And we're almost out of time it's anyway. It's more than I've ever Now we got... Before. What? Half a minute? But I can't go. But on. yeah, it's time to call it an episode. I know you want to get married. After these I, people are done but talking I and can't. talking I and can't talking. risk starting a family. So There's this no is Man in the Black Hat. And Game Collector. And we'll right, see Jack. us next time for more. Please. Oh god. Don't say it's anymore. Metal Gear Solid 2. Ugh. We're on the home stretch. Later.